everybody welcome to my usual me and welcome back to last oasis okay guys today i'm going to show you how to make a your very first quality station without the use of quality rupu binds we're going to show you how to make your quality word working station without the use of quality rupu binds you don't need them all right we've been fighting this forever I and mean, this is something that you can do in the very beginning of the game I don't know why. You can probably do it in the cradle if the cradle is old enough. I don't know why I didn't see this before. Uh, this was given to me. This tip was given to me by I could have. So I could have. Thank you so much for this tip. I truly appreciate it. This is a game changer, guys. It's for you to get your quality stations up and running as fast as possible. All right. So, guys, if you don't know how to do quality, you don't know what quality means, what it's all about, go into the top right-hand side of the screen. And in my playlist, I have a quality video quality resource video I want you to go check it out all right and then you'll understand quality a little bit better what it can do for you but in the meantime let's go ahead as soon as you get done with that come back here and we'll get on with the show all right so if you guys have already seen that video let's go ahead and let's go so right now guys you only need two things you need quality fiber and quality wood all right so just make yourself any tools that you can gather those with it doesn't matter what tools i happen to have an advanced hatchet but you can use a woodcutter hatchet and you can also use a, a sickle instead of the scythe i have on me uh, it doesn't really matter let me kill this rupee right quick all right so right over here guys i have uh, quality two um corn okay quality two corn so with a base tool you're only going to be able to gather quality one no matter what the quality is okay so we're going to gather up some quality 100 or, one, or quality one fiber i'm going to check get rid of this corn because i don't need it i'm gonna get rid of that stone because i don't need it i'll keep that fiber weave though um uh, but anyway so we have quality one fiber because any any quality material you come across if you're using a base uh a base tool you're only going to get quality one all right so now we've got our quality fiber i'm going to have to get some quality wood and so, like, I've got an advanced hatchet here, and this advanced hatchet is a tier four, which so it can gather up to quality 80 if it was a quality uh, tool. But it's not a quality tool, it's a base tool. Okay? It doesn't have any quality associated with it, so it's only going to gather quality one no matter what I find. I saw a quality one pine tree around here somewhere. We're going to go gather up this quality one wood, and we're going to, because we're going to need it. I saw it around here somewhere. All right, here's a quality one pine tree right here. We're going to go ahead and gather up some quality one wood right quick. I really don't need more than just a little bit, but I'll just chop this whole tree down. That way it has a chance to regrow. In fact, I don't need, I don't need all this quality, I don't, quality wood. We're just going to get rid of most of it. So we've got quality one wood and quality one fiber. That's all you need, guys. That's all you need to do this. So we'll go ahead and we'll go uh, into C, we'll go into, uh, we'll go into weapons, and we're going to make a quality one beat stick. That's all you need, guys, is a quality one beat stick. So uh, now I know you're like, what? It, okay, beat sticks, they don't gather wood. They don't gather stone, and they don't gather hot, they don't gather fiber either. And they won't gather corn. So we thought, I mean, everybody, I think myself and everybody else included thought the beat sticks, all they were good for was beating down Rupus in the beginning, and we were just bypassing these beat sticks and not paying attention to them. Sometimes the lowliest of things can be your salvation. So let me go ahead and show you what I'm talking about right now. Is that it? That's quality seven driftwood. Quality seven driftwood. We also have a higher quality than that. I saw it. Where is it? Quality 59 driftwood. All right. So. We have quality 59 driftwood and quality 7 driftwood. So we have two different uh, examples to pull from right now. Let's go ahead and let's, let's try the quality 7 first. All right, so with this quality 7 driftwood right here, guys, we're going to get quality 4 wood from a quality 1 beat stick. Now, this over here is quality 59 plus. It's higher than 59. We don't know what it is because I'm, I can only see that it's quality 59 because I am 59. You can only see as high a quality as you are level. But this thing right here, let's go ahead and hit this. What do we get? Quality 20, so quality 20 is the most you're ever going to get out of a quality beat stick. Okay, so out of a quality 1 beat stick, the best you're going to get is quality 20 um, material. So we're going to go ahead and gather all the quality 20 wood we can before this beat stick dies. I think we're going to be fine. And this is, this is the game changer right here, guys. You can do this right out of the cradle if the cradle's been old enough where it's creating quality materials. And you can find the quality materials. And you, you can do this by walking around. You don't need to, uh, obviously, I can see it right now. You don't need the range finder, but the range finder makes it a lot faster, a lot easier to find this material. 
So, yeah, it's the quality beat sticks that's going to do the trick. Now, let's go ahead and head back to camp right quick. Let's make, oh, see, is there another one? No. Let's make our, our quality um, station, and I'll show you what I'm talking about. All right, so to figure out what quality station you're going to get from the quality of materials that are in your inventory, you're going to take all of the materials that it takes and that number of materials it takes to create your station and divide it by the, quali the quality of the materials you have in your inventory. So like right now, I have quality one fiber, quality zero rupu vines, and quality four wood, right? You take those three, those three items and divide them by three, and you're going to get well, you go five divided by three, and it's basically going to be one, point whatever. And then that is going to be rounded down because the point doesn't count. So when you look into here, into your crafting stations, you're going to have quality one, quality one. And why, why are all these quality one? Why, is, why does it say I can make quality one? Because it takes four items to make the stomping station. It takes three items to make the soil excavator. It takes three items to make the fi fiber working station. Three items to make the campfire. It takes three items to make the advanced fiber working station. And, I, and my quality of my wood is four, okay? So we're dividing it by the number of items it takes to make the station and rounding down but right now i can make a quality one work at woodworking station right boom there it is we're going to use it it's a quality one woodworking station now that is from this quality four wood now if we go over here and we use this quality 20 wood which is the highest you're going to be able to gather with a beat stick so uh, now with a quality uh, 20 wood guys that's going to change everything so we're going to it's going to it's going to up us quite a bit so See, we can make a quality seven campfire, a seven uh, fiber working station, five soil excavator, five stomping station, five torque windmill, or a seven woodworking station. So we're going to make that right there. Boom. Because, and now we still have, I could make, I can make more than one. We can make way more than one. Let's go ahead and make a bunch. Make as many as I can. And there's a reason for this. Because once you break down these stations, you're going to get an average of the materials back, right? So even though I didn't start, okay, I can't do any more there, just those three. So even though I started with uh, quality zero Rupu vines here, if I go into B and I hit this disassemble and I hit disassemble this one, boom, all of a sudden I now have quality seven Rupu vines because it, it took half, it gave me back half of my materials, but it averaged it all out. So what we can do here is we can go ahead and go B, disassemble, bam. All right, and now I have two Rupu vines that are quality seven. Let's go ahead and get rid of all this stuff here. So we have quality seven uh, fiber, quality seven Rupu vines. Let's get rid of this other stuff. And now we've got quality seven Rupu vines, quality seven fiber, and quality 20 wood. If you take those three numbers and add them together, you're going to get 34 and divide that by three, you should get and round down, you should get a quality 10 woodworking station. A quality 11 woodworking station, excuse me. So now we have a quality 11 woodworking station. Let's go ahead and let's bust this one down. Disassemble. And let's see if I can make another one of those. Can I make another one with what I've got? No, I can't. I need one more Rupu vine, so which means I gotta go back here and let's grab, um, let's grab some more of this, this quality 20 wood. So now again, I've got quality 20 wood, quality zero Rupu vines, and quality 25 or quality zero fiber. And that, and so I'm going to be able to make quality six station. We're going to make as many as we can of those. We want as much material as we can get our hands on. That's higher, right? And can I make? I think I can make three, right? Yeah, I can make three. All right, and then we go ahead and we, then we're going to go ahead and tear these down. And then let's go ahead. I'm going to grab all the quality material I've got out of here right quick. We're just going to we're going to make what we can. I'm just going to grab all the quality material I've got. I want to see what I can make with what I've got here. Quality 11 woodworking station again. Quality 10. Quality seven. And we're going to get as high as we can from the materials that we're gathering here. And quality seven again. All right, so that's all I can do right there. 
disassemble all these. And what do I have on my person now? Now I have quality nine root root vines, quality seven root root vines. Um, I really can't do much with this, but we want to keep this stuff uh, around just because I want to go ahead and have this higher quality material just for future uh, future exploits here. So what we're going to do now, we'll go ahead and, and now I, the highest quality wood shaft I'm going to be able to make is nine. Oh, we're going to take this quality nine wood shaft right here. I'll let that thing do its thing. And then the best I can get out of this right now is a quality four wood uh, or woodcutter hatchet. Yeah, I can't do anything else. There we go. There's a quality four woodwork or, or woodcutter's hatchet. All right, guys. Well, even though I was only able to make a quality four woodcutter's hatchet, which is a tier one tool, which allows me to gather up to quality 20 material, when that stump respawns, I'm probably going to take either that or the beet stick back, gather as much of that quality uh, 20 wood that I can, and make the rest of my stations, which will allow me to make a higher, higher tier, not higher quality, but higher tier tool, which will then in turn allow me to gather higher quality material because the higher the tier the higher the quality you can you can uh harvest right so anyway that is how you make your very first station without quality rupu vines i am super excited about this revelation guys i hope you are too if you learned something new if you're excited about it give me a thumbs up if you haven't subscribed please do that right now as i always say i am my usual me you be your usual you and we'll see you in the next video thank you so much for watching we'll see you later Bye bye